Our teams are looking at the system all the time. When you're driving around and find a tree about to fall on the line, myself and certainly many within the company, if not all, notice those types of things, care, and we'll address them and we'll work to continually improve our system. Looking at reliability metrics and how is the health of all of our assets across the system. 180,000 distribution poles, 5,000 miles of distribution line, 6,000 miles of transmission line. And based on the information we get back from those records, we'll develop plans. Replacing poles, trimming trees, upgrading conductor, replacing insulators, you name it. You want to catch an issue before it becomes a real problem for customers. My wife and I now live north of town and we have three kids, so they keep us very busy. We live on a small little hobby farm. We have a bunch of chickens. Only one egg, not very many today. Our kids are big into animals, especially our daughter. She wants a guinea pig, we'll see where that goes. One of the core values of Ottertail as a company is community. Being your best self is blending both of those worlds together. Our goal as a team is to never have an outage or an interruption to a customer, period. That said, that's unrealistic. There's so many events that can happen on a system, three inches of ice buildup on lines or tornadoes. So we have a full team building apps to make our guys more efficient. During an outage, they'll be able to pull out on their phone exactly where they are, what's upstream, what's downstream, what the issue at hand might be. Customers understand there's gonna be outages. At the end of the day, they wanna know what's going on and when can I expect my power back? And so we're developing an app that will help us inform our customers what's going on during an outage. I drive by there, 78, those intersection lights. When a customer wants electricity or when, when they wanna turn on the TV or turn on an oven, we want that to work. We want power to be there. If there's a big storm, wind, ice, rain, sleet, you name it. We want the system to be able to handle it and deliver electricity to our customers.